I always knew that art could be used as a vehicle to, to build community and I wanted to make certain that I used it as a vehicle to create dialogue around issues of social justice because I had begun seeing more and more artists using art to amplify their voices and other people's voices but also to affect change. People from all walks of life have come. Young, old, rich, poor, black, white, and otherwise. For them, it was about wanting to learn more about the history of Black Wall Street, wanting to understand better what happened during the 1921 Tulsa Race Massacre, and to have conversation. I recall a young lady coming to me in private saying, you know, she had a family member involved in the massacre on the vanilla side, and she had never shared that with anybody. She was struggling with that history, being associated with this person whom she loved and admired, but at the same time resented and hated. Those who have known about it, they also know the history of their family's involvement in it and how their families have benefited from it. They just haven't been courageous enough to talk about it. And now that's changing. Systemic racism is certainly throughout the art world. The lack of representation of black artists in museums, the lack of black artists represented by white galleries, the fact that there aren't as many black galleries as there should be. There's a system that works against us and we want to dismantle that system. Seeing the art world today, there is a great response to black artists, but this has been a long time coming. Whatever I do, I want to make sure it makes a statement, it stands for something, it's saying something to somebody. It usually resonates with me, so I always hope that it resonates with other people that sees the work as well. From him, I've got exposure to black artists, and it helped me to recognize that this is what I want to do and what I want to say. I'm part of this, you know, just because you go here and you don't see it doesn't mean that you're not part of it. Being able to see this exposure helps you understand that, yes, I'm here too, I can be part of this. I hope we help New Yorkers and tourists alike to learn the history of Black Wall Street and the 1921 race massacre. And for us to figure out what we can do for the next 100 years to make certain that never happens again, but that we also create greater opportunities for black artists. New York is the place to make that happen, and that's why we're here.